Today's question is from Paul Morhen and he is asking uh, what is my favourite venue to play and are there any venues that I haven't played yet that I'd like to play in? It's Royal Albert Hall. Unbelievable. I've been really really lucky I've actually played at it three times. Once in uh, 2009 I think, that was with the hours. The second and third time I played it was back in 2013. That was with Amelia Mitiku who's like a jazz artist and that was an amazing setting for her kind of music. There's a lot of um, dynamic and nuance in her music so it really made for a beautiful atmosphere. You just felt the presence of the people that had been on it before you. If anyone's watching this that either plays the Royal Albert Hall or just goes there to see a show or a gig or anything, just look up because that was my favourite part of the whole thing. The playing was amazing but there was one section where I wasn't playing and I decided to just look up. I won't describe it because you've got to go and just look and you'll see, you'll understand what I mean and it just really took my breath away. There's a few other venues that I really like playing, one in Amsterdam called Melkweg. When you play there you have to park next to a canal so you have to watch to not get off the bus and, and fall into the water. I love Amsterdam generally so it's just surrounded by loads of buildings that look like they're about to sort of fall over and uh, they're all sort of leaning in and all the staircases are like that big and it's just really incredible. There's a few other venues that I love. There's a couple in California, Mountain Winery, which has possibly the most spectacular view I've ever seen at any gig. I remember waking up on the bus and just thinking, God, where are we? This is amazing. I hold a lot of love in my heart for that place. Also, uh, the Greek Theatre in LA, that is pretty amazing too. Um, I was lucky enough to headline that with Tom Bailey 2014. An amazing experience and the crowd were great and yeah, that was a real, a real moment again. Another one that we did on that tour in New York that was at the Best Buy Theatre. Despite the horrific name, it's like calling a venue Woolworths. The actual venue was incredible, not only because of the venue itself but where it was situated. It was literally in the middle of Times Square. When I was a kid I used to think, right, when I go play in New York it would have been at this kind of venue. The reality of the first gig I actually played in New York was a tiny little club terrifying for me at 17 all by myself that's another story for another time as for venues that i'd like to play everyone would love to play like the madison square gardens and all that sort of stuff for the you know for the prestige of it i'd like to play the o2 but i know that it probably wouldn't sound very good i've only ever seen one gig there that actually sounded good as radiohead actually there you go if i'm playing with radiohead then i'll play the o2 and that would be a perfect situation to play that venue red rocks i'd adore to do Red Rocks. I've watched a few DVDs of people playing at Red Rocks and every time I just think, wow, it just, it absolutely takes my breath away. I hope that that's um, answered your question. That's probably a few too many to be talking about, but um, yeah, join me tomorrow for another question. Bye.